Hey, hi everyone. Uh, this video is about how to draw a circle in isometric drawing, and uh, this circle will be from the front view. Okay, so what I have done so far is that um, I have uh, this capture, copy this image from the Google, and uh, I just cut this section. I capture this window through the pick pick software. Let me type the name of the software. It is uh, you say like uh, let me just insert the text here real quick. You just it's called PIC PICK. Okay, so this is a very good software. So I have used this pick pick software here, and uh, I have captured uh, this image. Only I have removed this excess section. Uh, let me zoom in a little bit here. Okay, so I have uh, re I just captured this section. I have pasted on this page. So this is the one I'm going to use uh, to draw the isometric uh, drawing. Uh, circle in isometric drawing okay so that's the some prep work uh, second thing I want to show you uh, you click on the view and go to task pens and then click on size and position okay this will open one small window here and uh, it will be helpful once I start to work on it another thing I want to show you is uh, you are in the view click on the visual layer and then click here here you can do some advanced setting here and then here you can change some isometric angle lines here okay so I, ca I don't need it right now but uh, this is the one that you can set the angle as I want to draw the line at the 30 degree you can set this one up here okay um, I'm not going to do it since I already have the grid okay let's see uh, what else um, sometime you don't want I, d I have disabled this snap and glue because I'm using this uh, image um, but um, if you are not using this uh, isometric image then it will be helpful S since uh, two lines are closer they just glue each other automatically okay so that's pretty much in the setting so let's start okay first thing I will go in the home I will select the line tool here okay so I'm in the line tool here and then I'm going to draw this line here okay let me undo so you can do and I uh, just want to let me make this line thicker so easy to see so I'm in the line you click on the line tool here you select the weight and let's pick the uh, let's say two one, uh, two one quarter okay, let's see how this line look okay uh, still not that thick let's see select the line line weight uh, I will go with the three point here okay then again I uh, undo this one to match here and let me make sure the lines weight is the three point here then draw one more line here okay draw one more line so I'm just making this square here okay. and then just I highlight all this line then select the line and then wait as a three point okay okay so since we draw the box next thing um, you want to draw the two lines here so those two line will go from here and you connect in the middle same thing here again I will do the same from this end now it will match here and then match here okay next thing I will select this um, line curve tool here okay that has a arrow I don't want arrow so I will go in the line I will remove the arrow so now my line will be uh, without any arrow and then again in the line tool I will set the weight to the three points so easy to see here in the video next thing I connect one point at here where my line and mid and then another line over here okay. and then you can adjust the size here actually uh, what I can do I can select this uh, draw this line control C control V okay. actually I don't want to join them and let me just cut that one I just need a single line here so I will draw one more line again 
from here to here now I just now this tool will tell me it is 6.9794 okay so I will just drag 6.97 okay 6.9794 so I will just uh, select this line again all I'm trying to do is make sure that my curve is correct 6. Point, uh, 6.9794 okay so now I know exactly my how my curve should look like and I just extend this line little bit here see if you're using the the paper you can just use the arc you can put your point here and you just make arc here but since I'm using the computer here I cannot do that okay, let me zoom in a little bit and this end will meet here okay and it undo uh, okay I'll leave that way now another line you want to I just copy and paste this arc here control C control V and then I can just bring it over here make sure they are aligning and then I just draw like this here okay next thing um, my center point will be here and I'm going to draw the arc like that so control C control V again now this time I will put one end over here another end over here and now readjust my arc so it look like circle here okay. then I do the same control C control V and then connect here and adjust my arc in the opposite direction here I wanted to just adjust a little bit this arc here. Okay, I think that's good enough. So, as you can see, that's how you draw the circle in isometric drawing in a front side. Uh, you can uh, refine this arc, uh, but since this computer, I don't want to waste too much time. But, okay, um, so hopefully, you like this video. If you like it, subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Okay, bye.